Okay, this question is from one of the Business Masterminds group members, Jessica Thompson, who is the owner of Jam with Jessica. And I've seen this a couple of times. Basically, um, there is a subcategory that's selected for um, personal brands and things like that. So I'm gonna show you, um, or actually show her, how to remove um, this from her site. So you'll notice she has image consulting, consultant, physical fitness, and personal coaching. So because of that, um, there's a subcategory here, so she is not able to change it to a um, public figure. Okay, so she's given me access to her page. She's made me an admin. I'm just going to double check and make sure I have the right um, access from her invitation. Okay. So this is her page, and you'll notice that when I click on About, she does have a location here. That's one of the things we'll have to change. And if you go to Page Info, you'll notice that she has her um, two categories, companies and organizations, and then um, whatever she had there before. Um, and what I wanna change it to is people and public figure. And you would think that that would change it at the top, but you still see, um, I'm just gonna refresh real quick. Um, you still see her old items. I'm going to go ahead and show you what happens if I try to change the subcategories. Okay, I'm just gonna remove all the subcategories that she has here is what is showing at the top and I will instantly get an error saying that I must select a subcategory and this is the issue that most people have so with Facebook what you have to do is a workaround okay so I am going to change the category to companies and organizations and then I'm going to select if I can find it Consulting Business Services, okay? It still won't let you change it at this point. I'm just gonna show you this um, real quick. Okay, I have to remove the address. I'm just gonna pull up a notepad so I can copy and paste it there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and remove her address. Note, if you are a company that has um, stars and you have um, ratings and things like that um, and people check into your location, you will have to select or deselect the option that says to um, remove the check-ins, but she doesn't have that, so that's not a problem. Okay, so there is um, one more step. Okay, you'll notice that it still says um, at the top that she's an image consultant. And if I go to the subcategories, it still will not let me remove these. At the top, it says professional services at a subcategory. You'll see that, but I'm going to go ahead and close Facebook so I can save the changes. And then I will reopen it. I'm going to go back to her page.
So let's add a category, but again, I want to go ahead and go back and make sure that I have the proper um, top level category before I make this change. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to remove subcategories, it won't let me, so I need to change the top level first. So I'm gonna change it to people and then public figure. and click on add a subcategory. And I'm simply gonna delete the subcategory. Okay. And you'll see that it now says public figure. I am gonna go back in and add her address and items like that. Um, but for anyone who is trying to fix this issue, that's exactly what you do and um, that should be pretty easy. Hey, Socially Nina here, social media strategist and owner of Nina Simone Consulting. I wanted to welcome you to Beginner's Guide to Awesome Graphics with Canva. In this course, you'll learn some simple tricks to creating your own graphics that will help you save money. Basically, you'll learn how to create your own Facebook ads, edit your own images, create collages, Facebook banners, you name it. Canva is a very easy and simple tool that you can use for free to create that graphic that you've been paying others to do. If you'd like to learn more about Beginner's Guide to Awesome Graphics with Canva, visit sociallynina.com.